The assassins arrived at 9.42 and parked obliquely to attack the driver of the Ford, a vehicle that I drive, and only I drive. They stayed there, and 10.01, Ricardo left, and I presumably believe he left to bring the car around to put it in front of the concourse. That's what he always does. That's what he always does. When he approached that vehicle and put that light on, they were alerted that the driver is coming, and he was mowed down in a hail of bullets, no doubt, at least 40 rounds were fired. Good day, my wonderful people. It's me again, the great, great, one more great countryman. Remember to like, share, and subscribe, and hit your notification button. Wanna just hear the clip in front of now? Now take it from the back, straight to the front. Now, this is Mr. Raja Khan, straight out of Diana. Now, I don't know say I'm the biggest stepper ever come out of Diana. He mix up in a all sort of thing, he won a phantom squad, he link with the, 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 the police and the soldier, government, minister. I now go, go too deep. In a mystery car, like me I said, for those of you who don't know this man, he's one of the most notorious stepper come out of Diana. In the federal time, 15 years of prison, for a uh, uh, narcotics thing and all sort of thing. He did a transport of some shoes and everything that. But that thing is a mix up in there. But him end up. Our whole heap of money in buy land from the government in the interior. Because those of you who don't know, Guyana are one of the biggest country in South America. And there's so much people live in Guyana. Anybody can guess? Eh? Guess how much people live in Guyana? 750,000 people. And then Guyana just get high. Like we said the other day, is the place to be. But him now, him buy all the palan and build a couple housing development, he own a couple nightclubs and a bag of different things. Uh, mix up in enough things. The police always are asking. Even a little tape with him and a girl leak on the internet recently, all of them things there. But out of that, I have to talk about. I have to play another clip before me go night as we move along. Before I move on, I'm going to think I forget about one. The country girl, country boss, hit your notification button. Silent, nuclear. Trinibas, Undocumented, Malcolm, Clarendon Boss, and the whole of the subscriber there. Big up on yourself. Remember to share this. Tell your friends and family about it. You see me I say, can I bring some value? And I make you know what I want. All over in the Caribbean. You see me I say, and I'll just Jamaica. Because we are one big family. Believe it or not. Anyways, we have a move on, and like me say, me I play another clip, and then me I go talk a little bit more. Me should have played the clip, but me enough talk. But me I play the clip now. Twenty-five at least hit his body. Ladies and gentlemen, that car stayed there for 20 minutes. A, a stolen car, stolen plates, and with at least two gunmen inside the high power caliber weapons. Shortly after the park, a police patrol drove by and they were not phased. They didn't leave that patrol car, 
stopped in front of the vehicle next to them. I'm telling you all this because of, because of evidence that are revealed in the public. They were unfazed. They waited for 20 minutes and they sh shot him at 10.01. Then they drove for 30 minutes at 10.29 they turned off the Eastbound Junction. I'm going to say that again. They drove from Palm Court. For 29 minutes, for 30 minutes, from 10.01, 10.28, 28 minutes, they drove from East, from Palm Court, all the way to the most populous and busy highway in Guyana, unencumbered by a single police patrol, even though, even though, at the scene, police were there harassing witnesses in minutes. So on the year where he must say, he must say, the man then did it and sit down. A police car come up and did it when the man then did it. Then the car drive off at 10.01. The man then make them move and slap up him son. After the man then make the move and slap up him son, then then drive to your next 30 minutes and no roadblock, no nothing. You understand? So, that go for sure, yo. Oh, them dirty police boy, they fight crime. I don't know. It seems like the police, them are Jamaica, Trinidad, and Guyana, them got the same police college. Because I don't know how them fight crime. But that you tell, Roger, he mix up in enough things. Because in you know, one of the in case them in 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 my name lawyer, big famous white boy lawyer, get convicted car. Them did a try fling with a witness. You understand? And enough things. And then you have one of the bodyguard them when we used to deal with, we used to guard him, come out and attack. But me not done yet. Just follow this equation. We are clear. I need a clip. All the way to East Bank. All the way to East Bank. This, this assassination has a particular signature to it. Especially in the light of the police posture over the past week. Not a single raid, not a single arrest, not a single witness, except the people who are there are being harassed. This car parked feet, yards away from the Prime Minister's residence and the President's residence. Over 40 high caliber rounds were fired, killing this boy. That car drove all the way to Suicide. Yet, the police, Guyana Police Force, has not considered this crime a major crime investigation. No, when you hear that clip there, and you're angry, the man is. Make me feel on him for something. And son funeral in there now. And son funeral in there. And him attack, and him attack to the media. Him say, him son demise was like an assassination. And him say, them there, just meters from the president and the prime minister's residence. And it speak to how the police them are angle and are do them job. Him say, seems like is there's a stone wall. There's a stone wall going on. And him pretty much know say in history come with a lot of baggage. Him even say what happened to him son and him it did really make for and it really, really bad. This is an upset man. Yo, me don't know what I'm going on in a Guyana, but a boy he must have a whole heap of money. I didn't have a whole heap of connection. I didn't know a whole heap of people. And 
they, they can look in at history like me I say, if that guy and I get caught up in a that, he get caught up in a this, you understand? So, that you would yeah, he nah go take it like that. Mr. Khan nah go take it like that. Let's move on. I mean, I play another clip. Right. This is it's common practice in Ghana police force to erect roadblocks when this kind of thing happens. Common practice. It did not happen that night. It didn't happen in the East Bank. It didn't happen in the East Coast. I'm going to tell you something. When the state security, that night, state security apparatus failed Ricardo. It failed him. And in the past week, the state security investigations has failed him and his family. And I'm telling you, history, history can tell us that when there is no state security, lawlessness will prevail. You hear how angry the man they get? And he might address the police directly and the government. He said, when there is a breakdown in the state security apparatus, there is going to be a sense of lawlessness. Now, to me, that sounds like an ominous warning. I just me, I don't have to believe it. Yo, now we'll move on and play one more clip and then roll it up. All kinds of sick and demented rumors are being spread. Some even say, I'm not even going to repeat the nonsense. But Mr. President, I'm calling on the international community as well that that assassination is recorded and spread all over the world. Yet, not a word, not a word from anyone, including senior members of the Ghana Police Force. Not a single statement. For some reason, for some reason, I believe that this investigation has been compromised. When you hear him address the government and say the investigation is compromised, all me I tell the Guyana government and I tell the Guyana police them on the better investigate a crime here because the man here looked like him upset him specifically address the full investigation in do all the discovery for the police them you know because him, him tell me where they are the scene he tell you what the police them are do. He said he might talk about this because it is facts. You understand? He said them totally neglect. He said he feel like it compromised, meaning that people upon the inside may know where I'm going. You know all them places they run. That a guy and a just like Jamaica, just like Trinidad. Now, Guyana, man them, especially the youth here, a rich badness indeed with enemies, a big time business. Man, I tell you that brother, yeah, really, really, really upset. You understand? So, yeah, this, this story, yeah, me never did ever do that story, you know. Me did ever just do a story for him. But then, when I talk to my, my people, them, and I do my research, and I say, John, no. I have to really talk about that money or something. So that's how comes to do that video. Yeah. Yo, my name is Countryman. Remember to like, share, and subscribe, and hit your notification button. Check out the WhatsApp group. Check out the Patreon page. Check out TikTok, whatever, Instagram. Give me some ideas for everything. I love everybody. I love all the subscribers. Them. Eat. I love all the man. Them. We are lick out for me. You understand? I love everybody. Countryman. I'm out.